Alright, so this is my rod and reel arsenal today. I mean, these aren't all my rods, but they're the rods that are most used by me. Um, so this is my, yeah, this is a medium heavy, seven foot. This is an Abu Garcia rod, although Abu Garcia is not that great. I do like this, these rods they make. Um, I got a loose speed spool on it, I'm pretty sure. This is a five, six to one with 14 pound fluorocarbon. I use, I mean, this is more of like, I, I throw big curly tail worms on this in the summer, jigs, just, you know, heavier stuff and stuff I want to fish along the bottom pretty much. Uh, this is my, I like this rod, this is my spinning rod, I forget. Yeah, this is made by Addictive Fishing. Um, it's an in, inshore slam rod, I got um, a Saros reel on it. Uh, I think this is like 50 pound braid. I just, I mean, I pretty much use this for everything. I don't really like using it for drop shotting because it's really flimsy. And for drop shotting, I like kind of a stiffer rod, but I mean, I still could. I, just, I like that rod too. Uh, this is just my little ultralight. Uh, crappie fishing, white perch, um, bluegill. It's just a little stupid quantum rod with a pen battle on it. I actually do like the pen battles for fresh water though, not for salt water. Um, all right, this is my top water rod. It's got a spook on it now. Um, it's a Triumph St. Croix. I actually got this rod for free with from someone I fish with offshore, but um, six eight to one reel. I'm pretty sure that's just a medium rod. Uh, I know that's a medium. It's a fast action medium, only six six. Um, but yeah, this I really like this for top water. I really like it, um, and the speed spool combined with it is also really nice. Uh, and I just fish straight braid when I fish top water. All right, this is one of my f more favorite rods. This is my G Loomis. Uh, I got it from the New River Sport Shop actually, and it was only like 200 bucks, which is really cheap for a G Loomis. So I bought it. Um, this is again like more of a worm rod. That's a brush hog there, but this is more of a worm and jig rod. I like I have two worm and jig rods because I really like fishing those lures. So um, this is a medium heavy. I got 14 pound. Um, Fluorocarbon on it, speed spool, pretty sure this is five six to one. I, I have five six to ones on my jigging rods, I like that. Um, so yeah, that's my G Loomis, I really like that rod. Caught a lot of big fish on that rod. Here we go, last one right here. This is my Temple Fork. This is like one of my first bass rods actually. I really like this. This is more of like a swim bait, jerk bait, and rattle trap rod. Uh, yeah, I just really like it. I got 12 pound fluoro on it, um, six eight to one speed spool because when I'm like chugging along with a swim bait or a rattle trap or a crank bait, I like six eight to one. It's like the medium speed. Uh, but some people fish five six to one, which is also fun. Pretty. This is a medium. Yeah, the six nine. But yeah, this, I highly suggest these rods. They are extremely durable. And I also really like the guides because like the ceramic is, it, it will not pop out. I know, probably gonna jinx it now, but they're really strong guides and it's a really nice rod. So okay. that's my stuff. Another thing I wanna point out is I think all these loose speed spool, they're like standard gear ratio is five, six to one. I'm almost 100% that. Right? I'm pretty sure it's like... What do you mean standard? Like what it comes as. Like almost all of them are like 5, 6, to 1. I'm pretty sure. Well, no, this... Yeah, I know. You can get them six, in higher gear, gear ratios, but like every... Yeah, most of them are 5, 6, to 1. Yeah. yeah. That's what I'm saying. I mean, that's a little slower speed than I like, but for like jigs and stuff, it doesn't matter because all you're really doing is running in the slack line. So. Yeah. And I, I fish really fast, so that's why I like my slower gear ratios. Yeah, you do fish really fast. All right, thanks so much for watching today's video. And if you're new to my channel, you're gonna wanna subscribe because we actually have two more videos coming out today. I'm pretty sure, no, one more video coming out today. But you're not gonna wanna miss that. No. Oh yeah, two, yeah. We got Luke's Tackle Arsenal, which is coming out in 30 minutes if you're watching as soon as I post it. And then we got 
his saltwater rods coming out a little later today. I'm not quite sure when I'm going to post that, but you're not going to want to miss that. So subscribe, turn on post notifications, and thanks for watching. See ya.